Wow. Okay. Exactly the same. You will love this. Really? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. After I tried it yesterday from you, I was like, ah, I gotta do it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's sweet. It's sweet, chewy, nutty. We really got this mozzarella corn dog. <laughs> Mm. So cheesy too. Great mm. breakfast. <laughs> <laughs> what is this here? It's called the hot soup. They basically have this mochi dough and then they put the nuts inside and then they deep fry it. I thought they just had fish cakes. Mm. Otherwise mm. I would have gotten this. is so good so he told me that the oyster is supposed to put a little bit of vinegar in it mm. it really brings out the flavor can't stop saying it it's so fresh Snap, 
This is pitch perfect, really got me thinking you and I could be something Pressed all the right buttons and now I'm done Searching damn tight in your time, I'm big around no competition Sweet like gelato, 되고 싶어 Valentino Rockin' on a high note, got a love in this soprano No 만나고 나서 절대 놓지 않아 바빠도 다른 여자는 없어, no Cause you're the one and only girl Promise, I ain't tryna play games with ya, girl Honest, you are not a side character Every day after day, I tryna go out my way So what does that girl do? Oh, I wanna, wanna, wanna See you every night after night Can we forget about time? Cause I wanna adore you Oh, I wanna, wanna, wanna Make you mine Lunch is over. Now we gotta walk it off at the Shinsegae Mall. Shopping! Shopping! The Shinsegae Mall here is the world's biggest department store. We'll see. We'll see. It looks huge. And it seems like the first floor, this is all the luxury goods. Um, yeah, we're just gonna do some shopping. And if there's anything interesting, I will show you. So the Shinsegae Mall here in Busan is not just the world's largest, but it's also the freaking coolest because yo, check this out. It has a whole ass ice skating rink inside the mall next to the food court so that while you're eating, you can still keep an eye on your kids or your wife. And another cool thing is that you don't even have to stand up to get your food because a robot will do that for you. Talk about convenience because you literally do not have to leave this place at all. Now I know we just had lunch, but there's always room for dessert. You would think that I would gain some weight with all this great food around me for two and a half weeks, but I actually lost two pounds and I think it's because of how walkable the cities are. Being at the world's largest department store, you can expect to be tired, but they said, hold my beer, bro, I've got a spa. After spending hours at the Shinsega department store, we decided to walk around outside and check out the Heunde area. We got tired, wanted dinner, so we went to the party, a buffet restaurant here in Heunde. We opted for this second option because our first option next door was fully booked for the night. It was $40 per person during dinner and the options were okay. Definitely not the worst and for $40, it's better than anything I can get out here in the United States. Uh, so, so full. Cool. We for sure got a money story. They lost money. <laughs> <laughs> the girls went back to the hotel rooms and they rested while me and the boys went out to a nearby arcade to play some games to end the night. What? Oh no! <laughs> so on the next morning, we took the KTX train from Busan to Seoul. We had some time left, about an hour, so we popped into this mom and pop shop and got our first meal. we got to Seoul. It's been about three years since the last time we were here so definitely brought back so many good memories being here. Today was basically just traveling day so we didn't really have much plan. We just came here to Myeongdong, got some street food, ate a lot and just walked around and took it real easy. Something I kept wondering before coming on this trip was how is this time going to be different from last time pre-pandemic and one noticeable difference that I was able to pick up was that there was far less food stands in Myeongdong. 
The toc is a um, really good touch. It makes it a little more chewy. Oh, is so that it's not just cheese. Mm -hmm. Oh, I was like, whoa, it's really mm -hmm. chewy cheese. Mm. I love cheese. Oh my god, uh -huh. So with that said, I hope it doesn't discourage you from coming because although there were less food stands in 2019, there was still a lot here. There's a lot to see, a lot to eat, and a lot to do. I hope today's vlog gave you some ideas on what to see and what to eat on your next Korea trip. I can't wait for you to see the next vlog in Seoul because as you know, there's a lot to do here. And as always, thank you so much for watching and if you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel if you like more videos like these.